Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today we are back at the Disneyland Resort. We have a reservation for Disneyland. Today's also Tuesday, which means today's new pin release day. <laughs> uh, so yesterday it was Monday and uh, I went to Universal. I filmed a video. I did a whole like video, but I didn't upload it or even edit it because like half of my clips didn't have any audio. So, oh well, that, that type of stuff happens all the time, but Anyways, we're gonna go inside the park now and see what's new. So it's basically 9 a.m. right now and here's how the entrance of Disneyland looks. Doesn't look too busy, but I am very late today. I don't know about you guys, but since I come here all the time, there's like a specific time I like to get here. And lately I've been here a lot later than that. <laughs> and about a couple seconds later, and now we're inside the park. So last week I showed you guys that Minnie Mouse turned back into Mickey Mouse, but it looks like they redid them all together. He looks very vibrant and nice and basically new. Look who it is, it's Dale. Morning, Dale. Looking good today. <laughs> it was so good to see Dale so early in the morning, but anyways, I think like every trip, we're gonna head to the Emporium. All right guys, we just got inside the Emporium and as soon as I walked in, I saw this shirt. I have never seen this shirt before. I like the different colors. It says Establish 55. This is the Resort, this is a nice shirt. Doesn't say how much it is, so I'm gonna say it's like uh, 36.99 maybe. And looks like sizes range from a small to a 2XL, and there's nothing on the back. So these ears are not new, but it's those Princess Leia bobble bar ears, which I think these might have sold out for some time because I don't remember seeing them for a while, but it looks like the Emporium got them back in. Uh, just in case you're interested, these are $54.99. This, on the other hand, is new. It's a new Disney Starbucks studded tumbler. Look at that. It's got the castle, and it says Disneyland Resort. It's the same tumbler, it's just the front and the back. So these are the same ones. This one's $49.99. They also have a reusable, recycled tote bag. This one's $29.99. They have this travel mug. Man, I love the colors. Little hidden Mickey. This one's $27.99. They have this bottle. This one's okay, I don't know. This one's $29.99. And then they have the water bottle down here. This one's $34.99. But that was basically everything new inside the Emporium. I think now we're gonna head to 20th Century Music Company so I can show you guys the new pins. Oh, look who's behind me, look. Where is he, where is he? There he is, Dale. All right guys, so we just got to 20th Century Music Company and here's a look at all the new pins for this week. So they have this four pack of ear pins. This one's cool. I think I like the Evil Queen and Maleficent the most. This pack is $29.99. Then they have the dancing character pin. This week's is Stitch. And these are cool because like the heads bob. And then they also have like a little stand in the back. This pin is $19.99. And they have this Hercules pin. Turn over time. This little sand timer pin. It's cool. This one's $21.99. And they have this Pinocchio Daring Journey pin. Ooh, won't focus on it. This one's $19.99. Then they have this pin with Donald, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. This one's $19.99. And then here's like a, a jumbo pin. This one's pretty cool. It's got Belle, the Beast, and for some reason Stitch is on there. This one's $34.99, and they have this four pack. It's Olaf in different movies, so he's in Moana, The Lion King, Tangled, and The Little Mermaid. <laughs> this one's $125, and they also have this mystery box, Awkward Moments. You look at the pins you can get. These are $29.99. They also have four new pins that is part of the Disney Awkward Moments line. And the cool thing about these pins is look, you can open it up and you can flip the image over. This one's $21.99. And I have this one. And again, these all have that feature. Such a cool, and they're getting really like, like, 
crazy with pins. Like, <laughs> for them to be able to do this, it's insane. Well, that was a look at all the new pins for this week. There was a lot of them. I think my favorite pins were the, the awkward moment ones, the ones that could flip the little like thing, because that, that was pretty cool. I've never seen a pin do that before. Uh, but anyways, it was kind of, I was kind of bummed out because I didn't get to see Millie again. It's been like, I want to say two weeks now, so I have no idea where she is. I'm guessing by now that she's probably like on vacation or something, but we'll see. Hopefully she comes back soon. But we just got into Disney Clothiers and it looks like there's a new Dooney and Burke collection. So let me go and show you guys. All right guys, so here's a look at the new Dooney and Burke collection. This one's a uh, collaboration with Disney and Joey Shoe. As you guys saw all the merchandise, you can see by the uh, print and everything. This is part of that new line that just came out. But in this collection, they have a purse, tote bag, and a wallet. So let me show you guys the wallet first. It's got the castle on there, it's cool. Uh, this one is $188. And then here's a look at the purse. It's got the same print as like the wallet. My favorite is the next one I'm gonna show you guys. That one's uh, the tote bag. This one's $298. And then lastly, my favorite. Look at this. It was like a work of art. This one is $348. And then let me go ahead and show you guys the inside because the inside is like super bright. Look at that. So I was talking to one of the cast members here at uh, Disney Clothiers and she was explaining to me how, um, cause you know how most people like when they buy lounge bags or Dean and Burks, they like the print a certain way cause of the, like, with the placement. Like let's say you want the castle here, you would look around for different walls and so you found the castle like right there. So like for me, I personally like the dog right here from Pirates of the Caribbean. So like I would get this one because the castle's in the front, got the partner statue and you got the dog from Pirates of the Caribbean. But on the tote bag, all the print on the front are gonna be the same. The only thing that's gonna change for like the placement is the top because the top is like these bags and then the same with the bottom. So we just got inside the China closet and they basically have all that new Starbucks merch that came out that I showed you guys at the Emporium. But the difference is I can show you guys the Starbucks studded tumbler up close. See, cause at the Emporium they had them behind plastic, but man, this thing is nice. It really shines in the light. And then like I mentioned earlier, it's $49.99. So after we finished with the China Claws, we ended up coming to Candy Pals because they have some new munchlings in stock. So they have Chip, Dale, and then a mystery box, which is in the shape of a food truck. So I'm gonna be completely honest, the plush are cool, they're awesome, but they don't smell like what they say they do. They don't smell like anything. Um, this is, or so Dale is the falafel pita pocket Dale with garlic sauce. That's this. And there's no scent. <laughs> and then chip is a falafel pita pocket chip with uh, tzatziki sauce, which I guess is this. And again, does not smell like anything. And then this is in a box, so obviously, you know, the smell's not gonna come through. But I think, I'm gonna try these. Mystery pack is $6.99. I don't know if it's these though, or if they're the same price, but it's not marked on there. And then let me see if it shows which plushes you can get, and it does. Looks like you can get a Minnie Mouse pepperoni pizza, Dante Mexican hot chocolate, and the Chip and Dale I just showed you guys. You can get a Tramp vegan bean roll, Pearl mochi beignet sundae, and then there's a mystery character. I like the box, the packaging is pretty cool. Man, I almost walked away, but I saw this one. This one's Squirt from Finding Nemo. This one's a concha ice cream sandwich, Squirt with coconut. And again, just like the Chip and Dale, there's no scent. And then I figured since we're already in here, I might as well show you guys the treat display. It looks like they have all the same treats for the most part. Uh, they have some of the Easter cupcakes still, but they have this Minnie Mouse one, this red velvet, this Mickey one, which is like a vanilla cupcake, I'm guessing. And then they have this one, which is chocolate with chocolate sprinkles these are $5.99 but that's basically everything new I was able to find on Main Street today oh wait look it's Nick hey what's up guys <laughs> just in time just in time I like your jacket yeah, thanks it's cool appreciate it
cold, so I need it to is, it is. It is pretty cold. Yeah. It's like gloomy, and it's funny because I rolled up my sleeves today thinking it was going to be as hot as no, yesterday. It's cold. Yesterday was bad at Universal. The it was sun will super come out. hot. The I hope not. Okay. Today yeah. or tomorrow? No, I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to come to Store Command, and if you guys are fans of like Pixar's like shorts that they do, like the one of the Bao Bun, they have a shirt for that now. It's pretty cool. Look at that. <laughs> this short I have seen. Oh, I love this one. It's got the ingredients. Just in case you guys want to make your own. Uh, this shirt is, doesn't say, sadly. And it looks like they have sizes small, extra large, and extra, extra large, and one three X. And then on this side, see, I have not seen this short, but Nick was telling me about this one. It's for the birds. Let's see, man, they're not putting the prices on the shirts anymore. I'm gonna guess they're $36.99 or so. But well, it looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 3X. All right, guys, so we just got into the Star Trader. You can see the giant X-Wing hanging behind me. Uh, they have some new May the Force Be With You merchandise. I'm going to show you guys that. So as soon as you walk in, they have this crew neck sweater, which is awesome. It's got Chewie and the Millennium Falcon on the front. May the Force Be With You. Pew, pew. And then they have the Death Star on the back a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. And it's got the Millennium Falcon again and TIE Fighters. There's a lot of detail in this letter. On the right sleeve is, let me see. I can't really tell, what is this? Is this Darth Vader's hand? I think it is. This is Rebel on this side, and then on this side, it's got Obi-Wan's lightsaber and Darth Vader's lightsaber, and then it says Star Wars. This sweater is, $54.99, and it looks like they currently have sizes extra small, medium, and 3X. They also have this long sleeve shirt. And then again, there's a lot of detail on the sleeves. See, it's like different colors on this one. And then on the other side, it's got the initials for May the 4th be with you. Yeah, these shirts are hard to pull apart, but you, you get it, there's the M. T F B W Y. This shirt is $39.99 and looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 2X. And then down here they have a new backpack, which it's not a launch fly. So wait, I grab two. It's not a launch fly, but it is still a cool backpack. Look at that. I like the little like pocket on the bottom. It's cool. This bag is $39.99. And they also have this shirt. The lightsabers is pretty cool. And then they have biker shorts. Then they're called biker shorts. It's pretty simple. It just says Star, Star Wars on it. And just in case you're interested, this one's $36.99. And they have sizes extra small to uh looks like a 3x so after we finished with the star trader we ended up going to tomorrow landing which there was nothing new over there so we ended up just leaving but now we're leaving tomorrowland all together and i think we're gonna head to toontown another beautiful and busy morning here at toontown it looks like mickey minis is currently closed might have broken down there's not even like wait times posted or anything and there's no line all right guys so we just got into the engine ear store and there's not a whole lot new, but this Minnie Mouse jacket is new. I've never seen this before. It's like a polka dot denim jacket with Minnie on the back. Uh, let's see how much it retails for. This one's $79.99. And it looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 3X. And they also have this shirt, which I've never seen before. I'm not a big fan of this. The shirt kind of looks, uh, let me put it nice. It looks a little cheap. Not a fan of it. And then they have the sweater. It's got little white polka dots. And then it's got Minnie Mouse, or is it Mickey covering his face with Minnie's bow? Huh. Let's see what's on the back. Okay, yeah, so that was definitely Mickey on the front, and then Minnie's on the back. This sweater is 
$64.99 and it looks like sizes range from an extra small to a 3X. So that's basically everything new inside of the uh, engine ear store. But look, Goofy's out right now and it's so weird to see him like in his normal outfit. Because lately we've been seeing him in the 100 Celebration outfit. Let's see if we can get him to wave at us. Hey Goofy! Oh, we didn't get a wave, but we got finger guns. Oh, we got a kiss. <laughs> So we just got inside of the Mad Hatter, which is in Fantasyland, and there's no new ears here, but there are some pretty good restocks. Like the Remy ears. These are a restock. And then these pink fuzzy ears are also a restock. I haven't seen these in a while. Doesn't say how much they are, but I'm guessing they're $34.99. But these are really popular. And so far, this is the only store I've seen these in. So in case you're looking for them. So we just came to Adventureland now, and we're over here where the treehouse is gonna be at or is at, and it looks like the top part is uncovered. Let me back up a little bit. So we backed up a little bit, and here's another angle of the treehouse. It looks like they're basically done from like that part up, the part that's basically uncovered, and then everywhere else that is covered, they're still working on. And it looks just like the concept art, which is right here. Let me show you guys. See, that part definitely looks the same, and then this is how it should look once they're finished. All right guys, but anyways, we're gonna go to our last stop of the day and that's gonna be Pooh Corner. All right guys, we just got inside of Pooh Corner and check it out, they have some Munchlings merch. They have the Stitch Plant, which is $24.99. It's pretty cool. They have a water bottle. That's so awesome. And the topper. This one's $39.99, and then they have four pack of pins. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of a fan of the pins. <laughs> I like Chipper Dale. These are $29.99 for the set, and then it looks like they have a new blanket as well. Which, if I'm not mistaken, looks like it's Pluto on one side, and then a bunch of different characters on the other. In case you guys are interested, this one's, uh, let me see how much it costs. This one's $59.99. Well, there wasn't a whole lot new inside of Pooh Corner except for all that Munchings merch. But besides that, I think I'm going to end the video here. If you guys enjoyed it, if you guys did, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.